This show is brought to you by Dharma Wheelies, Electro Pirate, Big Boy Farts 666, Jesus Penis, Despicable Dogs, Benjamin, It's Leon Motherfucker, Parkman, Phone Losers of America, Fancy Pants, MST3 Clay, Anonymous, Gordo, Crispy808, and Mr. Turbois. Thank you to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more about the show at immoralhole.com. You can find our archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can find our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash madhouse militia. You can help contribute to the show by visiting immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. You can listen live to our show on Fridays at 10 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Pacific at immoraljuice.com. We have an IceCast server, a Mumble server, as well as an IRC server. Instructions on how to use all three are on the site. Hi, Madam Mamie. Thank you for calling. How can I help you? Hi, are you the sister of the brother there? I'm sorry? Yeah, are you the sister? The sister? Yeah, the guy there, he said he had a lovely sister and that I should call around this time and she would answer. So you must be a lovely sister, right? I I think you might have the wrong number. This is an Indian restaurant. Oh. Yeah. Who said this? Oh, it was one of the guys there. He said, oh, yeah, I have a lovely sister. Just call here. <laughs> you know, call here uh, later on. <laughs> was this your server? Yeah. Oh, do you know his name? No, I didn't ask him his name. He just said, yeah, just call later on. There's lovely sister for everybody. Uh, I'm sorry. I can't help you there. Oh. Do you know anyone's lovely sister? (laughs) No. (laughs) I appreciate the laugh, though. (laughs) Okay, well, have a good night then, all right? I have to go look somewhere else for a lovely sister. With many more. I'd go to... Despite what you said. (laughs) I'd go to 11 or something for that, my friend. Go to the club. Oh. Yeah, I'm only 13, so I can't go there yet. (laughs) Bye, Chris. All right, enjoy your night. Okay. Bye, Mom. Bye. I love you. Bye. I'm a sutra. (laughs) Sounds like banana. Hey, is a big banana. Hello. Hello, big banana. Hello. Hey, Big Banana. Huh? What's it? Hello, it's somebody told me to call Hello? Say, I need to speak to Big Banana. Banana, the Banana, banana. 
Uy, banana, eggy, banana. E who is banana? Big banana. Big banana. What's it? Yes. Big banana. Bunty box. Here is Martella. Box. Shut up. Shut up. Bunty box. Martel Pachamo. You said hello. You said Me motel, 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 motel home. Carlos, we know. Come out to see your man. We are. Come out to see your man. We need to talk about banana. Turn the radio. I like to rent a room. Me yamo Carlos. No Come room. Come see him. No room available. No. We don't need a room. How about hayloft or closet? No, 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 no. Banana. Me and hey, Yama Carlos. Here with the banana. You We're have room. Your closet. <laughs> Oh, t'as que ça Excuse-moi, je, je, j'attends très mal. Allô? Allô, excuse-moi. J'arrive pas à Bon, t'as que ça va Allô? Je vous attends très, très, très mal. Allô? Okay. That's Bobby the Bonsoir. Come on, please, lady. New, new number. Hi, I just checked in and my toilet is full of snakes. Do you want them back? Hmm. Hotel Champlain, la réception? Hi, uh, I have an issue. Um, the people that I'm subletting my room to came down to try to get an extra key, and they said you wouldn't make them another key. Uh, yes, so that wouldn't be possible for tonight because the receptionist um, at the hotel is gone, and here I don't have the system or the ability to make another card, but if you go back in the morning, they would be able to make an extra card. Yeah, but see, I, I rented the room, and then I left the state, and uh, now I'm just renting people the room at double the rates, and I'm making money from your room, and they need another key. Okay, well, that wouldn't be possible for tonight. Why not? Is it because you're French? <laughs> no, it's because... Listen, I, there's... listen I'm a I'm big, important American. You need to do what I tell you. That's how the world works. America, America number one, A+. Plus. No, America and shit. No, your Good mouth night. is shit. Listen, listen, you son. Thank you so much for calling the front desk. How can I help? Hi, do you have holes? I'm sorry, sir? The holes. I'm looking for the holes for the room. You want a room tonight? No, I'm in my room, but where are the beef holes? I'm not understanding what you're looking for, sir. I'm looking, like, I'm in the room, right? And, the, like, I'm looking at the brochure that was left on my bed, and it's advertising beef holes, and I'm trying to find some beef holes. Give me just one second, please. All right. White will squeeze one in your beef hole, yeah, baby. America's favorite genetic calls in Canada. Spreading the good taste of the beef hole US. to our friends over the border, yeah. We love you all with beef in your homes. Oh, Good evening. It just Thank ran. You for, for three. How can I help? Hi, I'm. I was demanding for the beef holes. 
Hi. But hi. How can I I'm help? I'm looking for the beef holes. The what holes? The beef holes. I think you have the wrong number, sir. No, I, there's an advertisement on my bed. It says, are you hungry? Come get some beef holes. And I can't find them. I need some beef holes. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, I have some um, information. I have some flies and stuff. I have a whole list of different restaurants. If you want to give that a try. Yeah, well, I was really looking forward to some beef holes, if you know what I mean. <laughs> no, sir, I'm so sorry. I cannot assist you uh, in that l- area. Listen, we don't have... Listen, I was I was just really excited because my nickname in high school was Beef Stick, so I was looking for some beef holes. <laughs> well, I'm so sorry. I cannot it's assist It's kind of like, you know, a donut hole? You know a donut hole? It's that, no, the beef. To... Oh, I'm so sorry. Hey, do you have a beef hole on you? No, I don't. What do you call it? Um, excuse me. Um, I have a guest in front of me, sir. I will... Please hold Okay, me. I'll talk to them then. Thank you for recommending. Let me talk to them. Oh, beef stick. Try and get Walt Disney on the phone. I'm a resident in downtown Orlando. This is Maya speaking. How can I help you? Hi. Do you have beef holes down there? If we have what? Beef hole. Beef hole. Beef hole. I I don't understand. What do you mean? Uh, you know when you get hungry and you want to eat the beef. And you go, oh, give me that beef hole, give me that beef hole. But we don't have restaurants here in the oh, hotel. Oh, you, you have any sauces, sauce packets down there? Um. So I have my friend here, and we can just eat my friend, you know? Oh, we have frozen. Yeah, food. ask her to eat, eat me. Yeah, eat me, eat me, eat me. Yeah, ask eat her if she has the party hole. Hello? Hello? Hi, yeah. Yeah, who what are, are you those looking? people? Hello, how can Hello? I help you? Hi, yeah. how are you doing tonight, honey? I'm good, how are you? Oh, I'm good. I'm just here in my room. We're, we we have some food from takeout. We're just wondering if you have any sauce packets down there, because they didn't give us any. Sauce packets? Um, are you looking for... Uh, just a ketchup. That's the only thing that I have. Yeah, yeah, like ketchup, barbecue, so we can eat our friends' uh, ribs here. Okay. Me. Yes, I can give you ketchup. Okay. Uh-huh. Well, I mean, I'll come down there in a couple minutes. What okay, are those no noises problem. on the phone? Is that you? you I'm sorry, help? what? I keep hearing a guy saying, uh, oh, F me, oh, F me. Is that you? No. I don't hear nothing. Oh. You don't hear that? No, I don't hear not, nothing. Who's that? I don't know. The lady. There's still lady at the front desk. What? <laughs> this is weird. This is really weird. You don't know who that uh, is? Maybe, no, maybe it's just a prank. So if you need the ketchup, you can come down and I can give you a ticket. I'll be there. Um, but if you don't want to go online, that's really weird. Okay. Yeah, I'm interested. I'm scared. <laughs> it's okay. You can hang up. <laughs> I don't know who I am. Thank you for calling the EON. This is Angelina. Oh. Hi, I, I had a quick question. Yes. Do you guys happen to have any extra soap? Soap? Yes, soap. Yes, we have soap. I, I can't hear you. It sounds like you're on speaker. Yes, I have extra soap. Please take me off speaker. That hurts my ears. Uh, what is 
use that noise, damn it. Ah. Sir? Fuck me, fuck me. He sure got pretty mouth. Thanks for calling, Tom. Please sweet. My name is Loha. Can I help you? Hello? Are you on site? I'm sorry? Are you on the property? Um, yes, sir. This is the, the front okay. desk. There's a guy out in the parking lot, and he's got, like, bees dressed up as clown, clowns, and he says it's a bee circus. You ought to come out here and check it out. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, you said? Yeah. Have you ever seen anything like that before? Uh, no, sir. Yeah, you got to check this out, then. All right. All right. Is there anything right. else See that could happen with? That's all. I just want you to check this out. There could be something shady afoot, too. You never Something know. Shady going on. You never know. So if you can look into that too, I'd appreciate it. Are you a guest to us? Yes. All right. Uh, may I have your room number, just in case? Um, I'm not in on the property right now. I'm out where the little bee circus is. All right. All right. Thank you for letting right. me know. All right. See you down here. Bye bye. You're welcome. Love you. God bless. Betty Matal. Hey, is that Miriam in the background? Oh, cool. You just hang up. Betty Matal. Hey, you hung up on me and you're a gash. What? You're a gash for hanging up on me. Huh. Excuse me? Somebody's got to complain about that. Thank you for calling the Quality Inn and Suites. How can I help? Hi. Um, the, uh, the prompt uh, when I called, somebody's got to do something about the Kind of offensive. Mm-hmm. You sorry, can't can say you that. Me? You know when you call and there's like the little recording? You can't say that. Please fix it. Now. Fix it. now. This is a vibe. Hello? Hi. Could you please... Re- oh, sorry. Go ahead. Oh. Um, do you have a pr- do you have a good thing going over there with your fingers or no? What do you mean? Like, if if a guy came in and said he had all ten fingers, like, what what could he do with them? Like, what, what type of discount would he be entitled to with all ten? Nothing. Could he ever have all ten fingers? Yeah, but I have all ten. This is very uncommon. Like, most people have nine. I have ten. I have ten, too, so what's the difference? You don't have... Listen, don't lie and and belittle me. I have ten fingers. You don't have to try to be my friend or anything. I know you have nine. You know I have nine. You don't even know my name, so how do you know I have nine? But uh, but I'm over here across... Hello? Hello? Hands. Hands. Yeah, it takes two hands to handle a Whopper. Yes, did you order for a Whopper? Hello? How can I have you? Hi. It takes takes two hands to handle a Whopper. Did you order a Whopper? I did not order a Whopper. Are you sure? Because I got a Whopper right here on the line. D. White. Yeah, yeah, hey. Hey, what, if you didn't order a Whopper, then why is my pecker out? I want to suck your dick. 
I got my pecker out. <laughs> Is Universal? Thank you for contacting Resident City Universal. Thank oh, you. For the- oh, hi, hi, could you please could you please uh, put the Universal Soldier on the phone, please? I'm sorry. The Universal Soldier. I must speak to him. You do realize we're a hotel. You're calling, right? Yeah, and I need to I need to speak to your soldier. Have a good evening. Put the phone down your pants. I'll speak to him now. Thank you for choosing Tennessee America on Major Boulevard. This is Asia. Oh, hello. 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 Um. So something happened in the room. What happened in the room? Well, see, my friend here, Milkman. He told me if I lick my finger and shove it in the in the electrical socket, that it'll feel really good. What? And I did it. Yeah, so I licked my finger, and I put it in the electrical socket, and then my ass hairs caught fire. Go find you somebody to play with. Do that. Thank you for calling. Like, how can I help you? Hello. Please just suck my dick. Yeah, I can't speak. How do you how do you say the the quinta in English? I don't know how to speak Spanish. I'm trying to tell someone where I'm at. Yes, I speak in English. How can I help you? How do you know? How do you say it in English, though? I'm sorry. How do you say the hotel's name in English? I'm trying to tell someone where I'm at. It's La Quinta, sir. Yeah, yeah, but in English, how do you do? La Quinta, you don't have no other name in English. No, because I'm trying to tell the guy to come pick me up to take me to urgent care. Because I was in here licking the walls, and now everything tastes sweet, and I'm seeing things. Uh, just Where the fuck are you, dude? Where are you? Uh, this guy keeps saying a Spanish mortuary. I think he says I'm at the Alamo. Where, where, is, where are you? Uh, I'm trying to find out. This guy won't tell me. I'm... I went, I went, I went deaf in one eye. Yeah, oh, sir. Why do you need? Yeah, why do you need? How can I help you? I need to figure. I need to figure out where I'm at. Oh, oh, I need to figure out. Oh, oh. oh. Hello. Quit pulling yeah. my pecker. I told you. Hello. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, where, where, where am I at? I need, I need help with my, with my pants. My oh, 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 oh. Hey, rub it. Don't pull it. Why'd you take me off speaker? Good evening, Clarine. This is Anna. How can I help you? I have a problem. Okay. So, <clears throat> what time do I have to return the milkman? Excuse me? What time do I have to return the milkman? It was the... He said that his services are offered with the room. And I'm done with him. What service? But he won't leave. Well, he said that he does massages. And he's already done. And now he won't leave. And I want to take him to the to the front desk. Or I don't know where to take him. Um, I don't know, sir. You can call the police if you want. No, I mean, I thought he's fine. It's just I thought that this was like a service you guys offered, and I'm done. Now I don't know what to do. He won't leave. He gave me a massage. Okay, and what do you want us to do? In what room are you? Well, am I going to get in trouble now? I don't know, sir. We don't know for massage, so I think you're calling the wrong hotel. No, I'm calling the right hotel. Now he just won't okay. stop talking about my chorizo. Oh. chorizo. What does this mean? What does this man do? Yeah, I try that. It doesn't want to work. You can't hear the train no more, and I got it here. Evening. Thank you for calling. Hi, this is Quest for Universal. This is Ivy. I'm Hi. Hi, we're trying to run a train in here, but we don't have any grease. Do you have any room grease down there? Room what? Grease. 
room grief. Yeah. Do you have any down there? So we open the door and it's very squeaky. And we're going to have a, a barrage of men and women coming in through the door all night. We don't want to wake up the guests. So we need to grease up that door with some room grease. Which door are you trying to open? Well, the front door here. The room, you know, the room door. It's very squeaky. Is we want okay? some grease. Is it you have okay to come down in the fucking. You have to come down in the front desk, sir, so I can give you a key for the room. Well, no, we have the key. I we have a key. We just need grease for the door. I want to be a okay. caboose. Can I put you in hold for a second? How long is a second? Uh, oh. What's the room number? Milkman, get it out of there. Pass on that. Hold on, let me. I lost my key. Off. If I go outside the Milkman. door, let's just open the door here. All right. Okay, I'm gonna go outside. But wait, oh uh, shit! I lost culo. my. God, they have the phone. This is my culo. Milkman. Ah! Hello. Ah. Help! Milkman is shoving it in. Oh. Ah. Open the door. <laughs> Open the door. Open the door. Open the door. I, I don't make fun of how I talk. Open the door, please. Hello? Hello? Sir, are you calling Hyde Bliss or Crossway Universal? Oh, hi. Is this the lady at the front desk? Yeah, this is front desk. Oh, are you coming to the train? Are you going to get on the train? You have a free ride. I got a lem lemming. Thank you for calling the Hilton Garden Inn. This is Jocelyn. How may I assist you? Hi. Did my assistant call you? She I sounded like this. Is. Um, But I can call him and let him know. She said that she was going to lem lem me know. About the you gotta ask about numbers. The gotta ask about the lamb. And the lamb. You have a reservation here. Well, I don't know. She <laughs> she was taking the reservation and she was saying some really weird things uh, when she got off the phone with me earlier. She said something about shoes. Shoes. Is someone talking to you about shoes? No. No, there's shoes? no one talking about shoes. Okay. Are you sure? Because she said that the room had my shoes Very in it. sure. So I was there last week. Uh, I don't remember my room number, but it was under the last name Jones. And my, my shoes went missing. No, no shoes. I don't see anything about shoes. Shoes? No, I don't see anything about shoes. Yeah. Is it this property? Yeah, it was this property. What about some... Huh. <laughs> Thank you for calling. Hi, uh, my grandmother uh, got something. Oh. Oh. Hello. Mm. Um, Hello? Um, something happened in the pillow, man. Pardon me. Um, so me and my friend Alasma and my friend Leche. Leche de Caballero, um, we came to the hotel and we kind of, you know, like something happened to Pilo. What room are you in? I mean, I, I just want to know if I can come up to the front desk and get another Pilo, please. I don't want to tell you my room. What's What's the room number? I don't know. I, I don't want to tell you, man, because something happened to Pilo. I just want to come bring it to you, and maybe we get a new one, and that's it. Yeah, I would have to send it up to you. So what is the room number, sir? There's no way. I, there's no way I can come down there and get it from you. I, you have to come to my room. I would have 
Yes, we have to send somebody to the room because they're they're the pillows oh are upstairs God. on the floor. So what's what, what's the room number? Oh come on, no, we cannot do that, man. We we can't have you in the room right now, man. We can't have you come up here no, right we're now. We're just gonna come. To, we're just gonna come deliver the room pillow to the room. You're, you're gonna deliver the room to the pillow. Well, um, um, let me. Wants to join in, man. Ask him if he wants let me, to join in. Let me talk to El Asma, and maybe he can talk to you, because it's up to him. I don't know, man. I don't know. I put the El Asma on the phone. Here. Huh? Hello? Yes. Hi. What's going on? Uh, what seems to be the problem, sir? Oh, my, well, my friend here, he was making, um, he was making a milky goo. Okay. So he spilled some on the pillow. And he's just concerned, you know. So that that's going to Well, we can send trouble. you up. We we can get could we could send another pillow up to you. Okay, but this one's just it's more goo than it is like fabric now. You might want to burn it. Like we can burn it if you give us, you know, permission. We'll just, you know, take it outside and Okay, what what's your room number? It's the one you assigned when we got here. Okay, what's the last name on the room? Drinking? Jones. Okay, okay, I don't have time for games, uh, unfortunately. You know, I do apologize for that, but I'm trying to help you out here. What do you mean games? What is I'm the telling room? you my name. What, well, what's the last name? I said Jones. Oh, I'm constipated. But we came here via a church group. They didn't ask for our name then. They just said, oh, we'll get you the keys. You know, All right, unfortunately I, unfortunately, I don't have anybody but the last name Jones here. So Right. We're under the church, probably. Is it? Reverend Jim Jones. Hello? What's the room number? Here, let me hand the phone back. I'll go look, okay? Hold, just give me a second. I gotta get my glasses on. I don't know where I put them. We're gonna, give me why are you giving me the phone, man? I need to Hello? find out the room number. Hello? Yes. Bueno. Um. So, what happened is, like, my friend Milkman, he was drinking. We we're both drinking, and it, we turn off the light. Alasma had the camera, and they put the pillow right there by accident. I thought it was big fat milkman, but it was the pillow, and I didn't really mean to fuck the pillow, man. I fucked it. Okay, I just need to find out the room number, and we can get you another pillow. Yeah. Oh man, thank you. You're the best, man. You're. You're such an amazing person, man. I can tell this, oh. the sound of your voice is, you're an amazing man, man. You are the big, biggest person here. Okay, what is what is the room number, sir? That way we can send another pillow. Um, El Asma, he's, he's, he's outside. I think the door, he went outside and he's coming back. I think he's going over there to you. Ask him if he want to join me, man. Ask him. Hey, I'm calling Country and Joseph speaking. How may I help you? Hello? Hi, Joseph. I'm I'm morbidly obese and I need a room. What? I'm morbid, morbidly obese. Alright, here. Yes, sir, is I can help Hello. you? Hello? Yes? Yes, hi. Um, I'm morbidly obese, and I fell down in the hallway. Some children tripped me, and then they rolled me like a large blueberry down the stairs, and now I'm hurt. Do you need me oh, to call uh, no, the fire uh, department? That's, yeah. That's they put a whole tripwire right across the hallway, and I fell down like a fat tubalard I am. 
And then they rolled they rolled me down the stairs and I went bouncy, 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 bouncy all the way down the stairs. Here, this was me. I, I, re- I recorded it. This was me. This was me. I have it on my phone. See, this is what happened. They they tripped me and they started rolling me down the stairs. I ran I fell over this dog. And then uh glass started breaking. Like it was it was pandemonium. Yeah, see, the glass was breaking. There was there was a turkey. <laughs> there was a guy that's homophobic. I don't know, I don't know what, where all these people came from. I think that was one of the kids. He was the homophobe. Sure, in which building? Uh, I'm at the bottom of the stairs. Where exactly? The bottom. I fell. In which building? I uh I mean on the floor to the ground and then mm-hmm. the ass and then the hole mm-hmm. and then your mouth. Oompa loompa doopa da dee. I want to eat your ass with some tea. Shoes. Hello. I mean, she, if she wants to wear shoes, she can. I'm not going to... Yeah, there's a there's a woman here who has a foot fetish. I was wondering if you could help with that. If I don't run. Holiday Inn, this is John. I'm going to help you. Hello, uh, hello, sir. Uh, I spilled some urine in the room. What's your room number? I'm in 215. 215? What do you mean? Yeah, I spilled some urine. I'll get somebody. Well, I don't have nobody here to clean it up right now. You're going to have to just use uh, some towels. Yeah, but I spilled it. It's everywhere, and I've used all the towels in here, and it just keeps pushing it around. It won't absorb it. It just keeps pushing it around. Well, um, I'll have Steve, to the back problem is that you... Let well, get, the me... problem is that Steve... Hey, sir. Hold on one second, sir. Wait, wait a minute. Uh, Where are you this going? motherfucker. All right, sir. I have I have nanobots in my urine. Yeah, so we were thinking about the key card issue that you were having, the mm-hmm. demagnetization problem. That okay. if you you could put a yeah you could uh, put a protective stream of urine on the cards, and that would stop it from happening. I have to keep. Hello. Point is thinking. How can I help you? Hi, there's a guy here. He's um, offering to tickle my balls. I did not. I just, want to, I just want to tickle your balls for a little bit, please. Hello, Ampersand heard it a mark. Hi. I'm putting I'm putting a, a list here together. You sell ice cream? We sure do. Okay, and can I get ice cream covered in white goo? You can. Okay, what is the white goo made out of? Vanilla. No, no, that's Ooh. wrong. It has a bleachy smell. Um, apricot? Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, we have some of that. Okay. It's apricot and goat cheese. Oh, mmm, that sounds horrible. All right, I'll see you soon. No, it sounds horrible. What are you doing? Hi, I have a problem. Oh. Hello? Sir? Hi, could you could you come closer to the phone so we can hear you? Yeah, hello? Hey there. Yeah, we can hear you clearly now. Yeah, what can I uh, get for you? Yeah, my grandpa was in there earlier, and he said that he had talked to somebody about his uh, preferences, and they had told him he was a creepy old man. He told me that they they humiliated me. And when was this? He only asked them if he could cup their balls. I mean, it wasn't that bad. Bye, everybody. Bye. Oh, you oh, go bye-bye? 
Extended stay Tampa Fairground Casino. How can I help you? Extended stay Tampa Fairground right, Casino. How can I help money. you? Give me money. Hi, give I me gambled money. away all my money. What? Give me money. I uh, gave the money. If they can help me. What happens? I, I can barely hear away all of, I keep. I gambled away all of my money, and I won't be able to pay. Pay what? Child support. So when you got the wrong number, you need to call child support and let them know no, that. No, I need the I need no, I need the money back because I have to pay for my kid, and you guys robbed me. You robbed me fucking blind. Who robbed you? You did the casino. Your motherfuckers, you. No, oh, Ray right. Channel Legends the- robbed. This isn't the casino. No. You got the wrong number. You're not talking to the casino. No, I, I, you need to call the casino. No, I got Dad's credit card, and I went into Raid Shadow Legends, and I bought the pack for ninety nine ninety nine, and now we're poor. Do you take Bitcoin, ma'am? Do you take Bitcoin? Do you take the new Astro coin? This is not the casino. You need to call the casino. casino? Who are you yeah, trying to I call? Like, I have the lobby. That guy I, out in the lobby with the blackjack table was lying. Yeah, there. Oh, yeah. Good evening. Thank you for calling Comfort Suites at Fairgrounds and Casino. This is Matt Spinga. May I help you? Hi. Burning WD-40 smells kind of bad. What is it? You know, WD-40, like for uh, hinges and stuff. If you set it on fire, it smells kind of weird. I mean, that's a subjective uh, opinion. What do you think it smells like? What's that? What do you think, do you think it smells like? Same cost every I week, am I up? Russian. Hi, how are you doing tonight? Pretty good, how about yourself? I'm okay, I'm down here by the water. Mm-hmm. And there's a man here. He said he works for you. And then he accosted me for sexual favors. I am the man. Does he work for you? No. You you, listen. You want heat in your room tonight? You give me sex. Did you? No. Sir? Sir, he's saying that. No other ones here. There's a lot of people in the room all of a sudden. Did you did you invite these people here to my room? Who is, who is this? This, this? You said you're out in the walk by the water. Yeah, my name is Jack. I'm I'm uh, talking with the pool waitress right now, and she said that these men uh, were sent here by you. No, they weren't. Yeah. Oh. Well, they Where's said they that? wanted. Yeah, they said they wanted to come back to my room and see uh, how I look, uh, all you know, laid out. You watch them on the toilet. I don't care. It's, it is ready for you, Daddy. And why are y'all calling the front desk? What's going on? We're by the pool, and and the pool waitress uh, said that these gentlemen were sent here by you. To accompany me to my uh, hotel room. Yeah. Yeah, that's not true. We're big Husky. So who are they? I have no idea. Well, here's the thing. They're propositioning me, and it makes me feel uncomfortable. Okay. Give me that backpack. Mm -hmm. I'm going to come out there now, um, ask them to leave, but I'll be out there. No, but they're very big and ugly. I don't know. They might scare me. Touch it. All right, one second. Okay. Hi. Hi, we're by the water here, and our dog went in, and he won't come out. He, what happened? It was like an alligator, and the alligator, he chased my doggie. Yeah, we and think the alligator got... Oh. Yeah, our dog, our, our dog ate the alligator. And we're worried about his, if he's going to be sick or not. I'm the dog. I'm fine. Hello? Oh. Hi, Chutia. How are you? Sir, my name is Nick. This is Mortal Six. Oh, your name's not Chutia? Your name is Nick? Yes, sir. 
Okay. Oh, very good, very good. So what would you recommend we do? The the alligator is inside my dog's stomach. I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You're supposed to have answers for your guests. What is your room number? Be creative. Uh, what is your room number? 215? What number? Yeah. What's the name on the room? Gator. Last name Alley. Wrong number. Hello? Thank you for calling. Oh, hello? How can I help you? Yes. Hi, there's a little man. Yeah, there's a little man in my phone. A little man. Okay, I'll, I'll get it for you. Okay. Yeah, thank hello? you for calling. Jason Pradeep speaking. How can I? How can I help you, sir? Every time I, every time I open my phone, there's a little man inside, and he keeps asking me to uh, to do things, and I can't get him to go away. I tried swiping what and I tried all these things, but there's. I don't know. I'm six foot. Do you hear him? He's like a little man. I little. I'm six you foot. Man, know whom I'm talking with? Are you talking to? Oh, this is Jack. So there's a man on my phone. On he property? looks a little. I didn't. I didn't mean. Yeah, he. I, I said he's a little. Where you could, uh, you Thank speak? you for calling front desk. This hello? is Jack. How can I help you? Front desk. Hi. Hi. How are you? Yes. Hello. Hi. Well, 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 Hi. Let's get a little decorum here. Let, let's be friendly. God, you, you sound like you're trying to rush me off this telephone. No, I'm just trying to find out what you need from me. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, I'm I'm just. Can you move a little bit to the left? Uh huh. Are you trying to take my picture? D- no, no. Just <laughs> just move to the left. Just I'm trying to get a better view. Move to the left just a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Steve, uh, that's it. Yeah. Steve. It's my turn with the binoculars. Yeah. Here, here. You take you take one side. I'll take the other. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. How can I help you guys tonight? Here, here. You, gra- you grab my joystick. I'll grab your joystick, and it won't be gay. Can you bounce up and down, please? Bounce down. All right, guys. Seriously, do you need something? Uh, yeah. Yeah, but no woman will give it to us. Yeah. Hey, um, you boys touch, playing on the phone again. Touch, touch my logistic controller. Oh no. Yeah. Oh no. I'm not telling you kids you. again. I'm sorry. Get off the phone. Uh, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna to hang up now. Okay. Uh, we're talking to a librarian about books we're gonna read this summer. That's what okay, we're doing. Up now. young man. You don't get off this phone right uh, now. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, can you hey. move a little bit to the left there, Jerky Nips? Yeah. Hey, Steve, yeah. can I share the binoculars? I want to see him, too. Yeah. He looks like he oh, has a God. turtle. He looks... Are you calling me online? We you calling me, Kitty? Hello? 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 Yeah, Hilton Gardner, this is Jay. Can I help you? Hey. Hello? My mom hey. Is supposed to check in. Hey, Jay. Hey, hey. There's some guy I got on the you phone. On call, yeah, you got, you on call, right? got you on caller ID. I'll Go. call Tampa police. Go fuck the dog. Yeah, I want you to call my... Hi, 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 hi. Hi. Thank you for calling us. Hi. Hi, did you, did you say your name was menstruation? Mm. No, I didn't. What did you say your name was? I this this phone is terrible. Hey. Piano Dix. Thank you for calling Hampton Home Two Suites Tampa Channel Side. This is Jason. How may I help you? Hi. How are you? This is I'm doing fine. How can I help you? Hey, um, so I'm in my room, and I'm making a big meal for my whole family. And uh, 
uh, the hot. Yeah, it, that in Japan they say that's a a compliment if somebody burps, right? So, um, sir, so you're calling from yeah. an outside line. Oh. What kind of? <laughs> There's someone. Thank you for calling the Tamp Edition. Hey. This is Carolee. Hey, Carolee. How are you? I'm great, thank you. How are you? Well, I, I'm doing all right. But um, I've had a couple of guests, a couple of business associates that said they were accosted and prevented from coming to my room. I'm sorry? Yeah, well, they were supposed to come to my room to collect the package to take the Tijuana. Uh, but they were told to turn back because they didn't know my name in the room that it was associated. Okay, right. So uh, normally that that is standard procedure. If they don't know the room number or the name, that we can't just, you know, we don't let people into the hotel without uh, permission from the guests originally. Oh, but I, I gave them permission. They're coming to pick up some of the Colombian gold as it is, and uh, they need to mm-hmm. get this down to Tijuana ASAP. And we're in, so I don't see that you're calling from a room in-house. Are you? I'm calling from um, my cellular telephone. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. See, I, I don't like using landlines because it, tie, it ties me to a location, and then it makes it very, very easy for the police to get a hold of me, and I don't like it. And it also lets people know that you're an aged boomer who would use a landline. Yeah, that's true. Uh, I'm sorry? The phone was shoved in my ass. I said that by calling from a landline, you're communicating to a potential mate that you're an aged boomer. And that's not good. Oh. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, may I place you on a brief hold and get somebody to come right back on the line and speak to you? Just one moment, no. please. No, no, absolutely not. No, no. we have a we have an impatience immediately. We have an impatience <laughs> disorder. I take medication for impatience. Okay. Okay. Um, well, I do have to put you on hold. Yeah. I do have some people. I'll be right back on the line. Okay. Thank you so much for no, holding. No, doctor's, doctor's orders. Doctor's orders. Doctor's orders immediately. She's not accommodating of my disability. Yeah, Yeah, she she doesn't know your desk yet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you for calling the Meridia Downtown Tampa. This is BJ. How can I assist your call? How you doing there, BJ? I'm doing fine. All right, now listen. Take two steps to the left. Mhm. All right. No, no. One, one more half step to the left. Okay. Are those nips hard? Say what? No, I'm. I'm just looking through these these binoculars. I'm in. The, I'm out in the parking lot. Are those? Are, I mean, are they normally hard like that? Hey, hey. I suck like my fucking dick. <laughs> Hello. Hello? Who is this? Who is this? Oh, this is Jack. They call me Jack Jack B. Nimble, Jack B. Quick. Jack's got Jack, an abnormally Jumbo. large dick. Right, so I want you to put it in your mouth and suck it. The operator. Hello, thank you for calling the Bremer Hotel Tampa Walk. This is Lorraine. How can I help? Lorraine? Yes. Hey. Hey there. Hi, how can I help you? Yeah, so, yeah, we have a bachelor party in the room, and uh, nobody showed up. So we're just going to see if anybody wants to come over. There's beer. There's, uh... Bitches. And, yeah, in that. All right, I'll definitely... Here, I'm going to take, the, I'm gonna take the other extension. I'm going to knock on this person's door. I'm going to knock on the neighbor's door to see if we get anybody to come with us. Yeah, good you idea. You should not we'll do that. Down the hall, see if they get down. I'm not, I'm not knocking. I'm knocking. Have a knock, wonderful knock. day. Hey, tell them we got a bunch of ranch Doritos. She told us. Then you come to the car watch. I may help you. 
Hey, are you making fun of my voice? That's not nice. Sir? Sir, I haven't even heard your voice until you spoken. Now, I called earlier, and you were talking like that. I just figured I'd give you another chance to talk to me straight. Sir, I haven't talked to you the first time I picked up the phone since my shift. You know, it's really funny what you're doing there with your voice. It's really funny, and it's really pissing me off. Do it again. Come on. Do it again. Uh-huh. That's right. Thank you for calling La Quinta Inn and Suites. This is Milton. How may I help you? Hey, man. I'm wondering if the Continental Breakfast is going to be available tomorrow morning. Yeah, there's breakfast tomorrow. What kind of eggs? What kind of eggs? Is it the eggs with hot or heat? It's full breakfast from 7 to 10. What about the eggs? What kind of eggs? Is it, is it hot? Is it heat? What is it? I don't know. Okay, I'll pass the phone to my little brother. He has a question. Hello? Yeah. Hi, do the rooms come with Xboxes? No. But I have to go, though. So, bye-bye. Why? Where are you going? Hey. Thank you for calling him tonight. How can I help you? Hi, do you have a continental breakfast? Yes, we do. Hello? Yes, we have a breakfast. Say yes. Yes, we yeah, do. Yeah, a continental breakfast. Okay. Um, me and my friends are going to be coming in for the continental breakfast championships where I will be challenging the great Cyrax. Um, what time does the event start? We don't have that event here. Well, you have the continental, right? We have, we have breakfast here. Yeah, does that involve eggs? There's eggs. Okay, were those were those uh, cooked with heat? Uh, yeah, they put in the oven. Okay, and I have I'm traveling with my infant son. Uh, will there be uh, milk milk available? Did you say impotent son? Yes, impotent son. That's you. You asshole, son of a bitch. I, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need a woman to breastfeed him to calm him down when we come for breakfast. Oh, real okay. Yeah, we have one of those available twenty four seven. Okay, is is it your mother? No, it's your mom. You no, got fruit loops. Hey, you got fruit loops. Yeah, we need fruit loops. Wait, what, loops what are you doing on the milk. phone again? Oh no, it's mom. No. no. Oh, please, no. I want fruit loops. We were calling the library for the reading program. Oh, is this the reading program? program? I got a big bug. You got to call. Sir, hello. Hi. How about you call two fingers, one man's asshole? Who is this? I'm gonna walk. I'm gonna walk my fingers up your dialing pad, but buddy, how about that? Good luck with that one. So you me. It's not for free. Everyone's got a break there, sugar chips. You guys call yeah. sex hotline again? Yeah, he's saying I gotta pay to spray. Okay. No, we called. This you is need the, to hang up. Hang up. This is the Rudolph number. Ninety-nine cents a minute to hear about Rudolph and this and the elves. Oh, yeah, he had the, the, the reddest hey, nose ever. I give you $5 for $5. Nah, give me a hand nah, job. Nah. I give you, give me $5 nah. for hand job. Okay, Grandma got resurrected, and she killed all the elves and the reindeer. <laughs> oh, that's sexy. <laughs> I'm getting so turned on. <laughs> so lighthearted. So, so hard. All right, I'm going to tell him that story at bedtime now, but seriously, who are you? Who are you? Are you yeah, my son called this number, and I don't know who the fuck I'm talking to, but this is getting a little creepy. Well, y'all called me. Y'all called the hotel. So I yeah, I understand you. that. My son called you, and they're listen, weird like that. But listen, I don't listen, know who they're talking y'all, to. Y'all, y'all, y'all. You you're talking to a friend of Hampton Inn. Mom, what? The, uh, number <laughs> one on Ray Channel Legend. <laughs> oh my God! Thank you for calling, Sunrise. Then. Oh Hello? my god. 
Hello. I'm Hello. wondering if I can. Hey, is your restaurant open? What? Is your restroom open? Is your restroom open, lady? We don't have any restroom. Fuck. I'm going to shit myself. Oh, no. no, she does have a restroom. It's her mouth. Oh. Hey there. Hello. How are you? How are you doing? Fine. I am fine. Yeah, you're fine. You sound fine. Mm. Hello? What's up, baby? What do you need, sir? What hey. do you need? Wait, are you a man or a woman? Tell me. Woman. That's what mm. I thought. I said you sound fine. You sound good, you know? Happy. Mm-hmm. You good? Everything? Yeah. 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 Good. Yep. So, what do you want? What do you need, sir? Ma'am? What do you need? I need some... Uh, I need some alone time with your husband. Cause oh, what, what's the name? Yeah. What's the name? My name or his name? Hmm? My, your name. Yeah. Oh, my name is Bod. What are you doing? Hello. Hello, my name is Bod Bod. Hello. Can I help you, sir? Yeah, I want to have some. Uh, I want to. I want to. I want. I want to pass time with you. My name is Bod Bod. So what pass. you need? I. I need. What is she talking about? You know, she shouldn't hear what we're talking about. Honestly. Milky Goo is coming out. Hi. I'm here. I'm drunk. And there's a gas. It smells like sulfur in the room. Okay, what room are you in? I'm in the bathroom. My son's in the bed bedroom. Let me hand him the phone. I'm passing gas. Hi, please help. It's very smelly in here. Thanks for calling Super Air Sulfur. How can I help? Hey, Ben Kilori Chut Marina, Kutar Vilay Tor Maria Hankia Chudiala. How are you? Uh, I'm fine. Yeah, what did you, you understand mean? anything that I just said? Did you understand anything uh, that I said or no? Uh, no, I did not understand. Oh, where are you from? Uh, I'm, uh, we are in uh, Sulphur. In sulfur? Yeah. No, I mean, where where is your mother country? What is your mother country? Uh, where is that? Where is that? Okay, there's a planet. Uh, uh, so know. do you need anything? Yeah, which continent are you from? I'm doing a school research paper. Uh, yeah. Uh, so is there anything I can help with the uh, mortal information? Are you an alien, sir? Are you from Earth? You know. Uh, do you do you need a room or something? I need something. Or why are you being so secretive about where you're from? Uh, are you with a secret? You said you're from NASA? I'm sorry, sir. If you don't need anything else, then I need to hang up. Well, see, here's the problem. Last night, there was a big flash in the sky, and there was a thud in the backyard. And a creature emerged from the glowing hole in the ground. Okay, sir. And next thing I know, next thing I... Hey, 
Next thing I know, I can't help. I'm talking to you. I can't help with. I can't help you with anything with that kind of information. Sir. Okay, okay, okay. I'll t I'll follow. I'll follow the protocol. How much is a room there per night? It's seventy-four eighty-eight. And what does the room include? Uh, the room includes a refrigerator, a TV, an oven. Okay. And now, are you an alien sent to Earth to destroy us? Bye. I knew it. You felt they had enough. Guest services, this is Kathy. How may I help you? Hello, operator. Um, there's uh, some kind of uh, bad smell up here. It's like sulfur and rotten eggs. Alrighty, and what room are you in? Um, bad. Sorry, I can't read. Now, why are you making the boy feel bad that he can't read? I'm I've been hiding it from his mother for like two years. Yeah, I'm I've been hiding it from his mother for like ever. Uh, sir, that yeah, sounds like a it, you problem. Yeah, okay. That's not me. How is that a me problem? I'm 47. It's, it's these terrible, smelly schools and sulfur that haven't taught my boy to read. I mean, I also went to sulfur, and um, I have something to admit. I can't read either. See, it's all coming out now. The whole town of sulfur can't read, and I blame the school I, system. I thought it was obvious. I mean, how did you even... How do you even do your job there if you can't read? I put Why do you have signs with words on them? I let my cat just write. How do you read order? And, and I just like I hope for the best. I knew the cats were smarter than people. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, what other creature can enslave another to to feed them and scoop their poop and do their general bidding? I mean, that takes I mean, a master class in genius manipulation. But that's also I mean, human infants. You know, babies, they kind of do the same. Yeah. But then they grow up and hate you. See, cats don't do that. They don't. You're right. But that could be the Once again, cats are thing. better than people. Oh, absolutely. 100%. All joking aside, I agree. Cats are better than people. All right. At least we're on the same page. Uh, you can't read, my boy can't read, and the cats are better than people. All right, we're, we're getting somewhere. Yeah. That's, a, that's the, you know, the general idea. So if you, can't, if you can't read, how do you know that you're going the speed limit? Or not? Oh, I don't. Go the speed. Speed. I pedal to the metal, honey. I am speeding through this town. I see. How do you know to, that you're buying 125 proof alcohol if you can't read the bottle? Mm -mm, that's do you it. taste it? In the fast lane. I thought I was drinking. Do you, the you open the Turned bottle? It, it was vodka the whole time. Yeah, Dasani is the 13th step in the 12 step recovery program. Except that it's not Dasani, it's Smirnoff. Yeah, but also I can't count, so I went to sulfur. Um, but, um, oh, you can't yeah, count either. No, I can't. Um, I apologize. I really got to get back to my work. Um, so thank you so much, and y'all have a good day. But, but how 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 can you work though? How do you how, how do you money make? The cat's running across the keyboard. I'm I'm happy for the best. Yeah, I guess I'm living so. on a prayer. Yeah, I guess we covered that already. I'll let you go back to pretend that you're doing the job that the cat's really doing. All right. I appreciate it. Thank you so much, and y'all have a good night. All right. Thanks for keeping sulfur going. <laughs> no problem. Bye. Hi, this is Kaylee from Vinton Cobblestone and Hinton Suites. How may I help you? Hi. How are you doing Hi. tonight, honey baby? I'm good. How about you? Oh, I've been drinking. I'm here with my family. We're uh -huh. up here in the room. But there was a man outside, and he was knocking on the door, and he was accosting me and my wife and my children for different things. Like, first he asked if I could suck his you-know-what. 
so that's why I'm calling. But then he kept knocking, and then my wife, you know, started talking to him through the door, and he asked for other things that are not so nice. And then my kid comes over, and, and he asked my son for his comic books. Oh my! Okay. Um, hold on a minute. And he just, said he works for you. He said he's your janitor. He's and our he, janitor. He cleans up. Yeah. There's someone that's knocking on doors asking for stuff, saying they're our janitor. We don't have anyone here tonight. Exactly. And some man just called saying that he was asking his family for comic books and then you know what and stuff like he's that. He's in the building? Mm-hmm. It was sex. It was lots of dirty sexual things. It was lots of dirty, dirty sexual things. Yeah, he said, he said can you suck my, my D? Huh? Can you suck my D? He kept saying. And what then my wife, she went up to the door. 215. My wife, she okay, went to the door, and okay, he y'all said, stay in hey, the room. I'm going to eat it. I'm going to eat it. And then he, she could see through the peephole, he was holding up uh-huh. a, a whole stack of, like, cooked okay. ribs. And he kept saying, I'm, I'm going to give you my it. manager. I'm going to eat you like this. I'm going to eat you like this. Okay. Okay. I'm going to give you the my man- to my manager. She's going to handle okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hello, this is Tammy. Hi, yeah, there's a man outside the room. He's accosting us for sexual favors and comic he's, books. And he's, what room are you in? 215, and he's holding up. My wife's looking at, through the peephole right now. She said he's he's holding up like a big stack of like barbecue ribs, and he's saying, I'm going to eat you, I'm going to eat you like this. And she invited him in. Sir? He's showing us his ribs. What room I don't are you want in? It. 215. He Have has a motel uniform on. Yeah, she let him in and he's showing us his ribs. This is a joke. Is it? Where's the joke? How is it a joke that there's a stranger in my room? Why would you let a stranger in your room? I didn't let him in. My wife let him in. Hey, can you suck it? Suck it. He's got a blue tie on. I'm calling the police now. Thank you. Help! Help! It's no! Me, help! Man. Hey, come over and suck Help! Hey, come here. The girl in my shirt. I'm here. Stop it now. Give me back that shirt, dear. I got my pants off. It's all right. I hired him. This is going to be hot. Oh, that explains it. Sometimes that happens. I'm sorry. I apologize. Camping in an orange truck to help you. Hi, listen, my ass is on fire right now. Oh, God. No, I've got, I ate something really, really bad, and I've got the ass burns. It happens to the best of us. I I know I I know, but I've run out of all toilet paper and whatever toilet paper you have in here. It it's exasperated the problem. Exasperated the problem, and it's making it just just burn even more. Good God! Well, I hope you can get some help for that. (laughs) God damn it! Is there anything else that you maybe think I could help you with? Okay. Hello. Actually, are you saying that I ruined somebody's call? I'm, uh, no. I'm going to ruin Clay's eyes. Oh, I thought you were mean, met me. I'm no. sorry. Oh, no, no, try harder. I'm just, I'm just so trying to All right, I'll try harder, too. Hello? <laughs> we're Hello? trying to put it in harder, but it won't go. We're trying over. harder. Keep trying. Yeah, we're trying, to, we have to get, we're trying to get all five of them in, but they won't go in. The key won't we're go trying in to the make hole. it fit. It won't, yeah, if we can't get back in the room. <laughs> We're trying to get the door open. We have open. a party so hole. We'll no grease. All we have like five people here. We're all trying no and it's more. no go. Volumes <laughs> <laughs> all over the place. Hello. Hello? Can you speak up? Hello? Hi. Let me put my brother on. He's I. He's beating me with a whip. He's beating me. He's beating me with a whip. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hello? Charlie's in Weatherford. How may I help you? 
Hi, there's a man in my room, and uh, he looks kind of transparent. Did you send him up here? I'm sorry, could you repeat that? There's a man in my room, and he looks kind of transparent. Did you send him up here? I did not, sir. I'm sorry. Room 52. Hmm. I... Sorry, I... I didn't, no. He says you sent him up here. Here, I'm going to put him on the phone. Hello? Hello? Hello. Hi, how you doing? I'm good. I'm up here, and you're down there. Yeah. Okay. I'm in here with him. <laughs> okay. And I'm touching him. Okay. With my sheet. I'm wearing a white sheet on my head. He doesn't know I'm not a ghost. Okay. I didn't cut out the eyes. That's probably why. <laughs> I'm so sorry, sir, but I don't have time for this right now. I don't have time being here, alone, confused. Then the Ghostbuster, then. You have one on site, right? Tell us when you have the time. I uh, no, I don't know any Ghostbusters. <laughs> He's probably wearing like overalls. That has Ooh, something that it. looks kind of like a vacuum cleaner on us. I'm so sorry, sir, but I seriously don't have time for this right now. Yes, I'll, transfer you the, I'll transfer you to the front desk, and then someone else can talk to you. Hold Hooray. on. One Thank that you. Is a, Thanks, buddy. No problem. Speak night, Elder. Your call is being transferred. Thank you for calling Weatherford Hotel. This is Lucky. How may I help you? Hello? Hi, I just unlocked the Hydra and Raid Shadow Legends, and it killed me quick. 129,000 damage. You played Raid Shadow Legends. Good evening, Baymont by Wyndham. How can I help you? How can you help Hello? me? Hi. Yeah, my brother was here. He was, he's he's in the toilet. He's having a hard time pooping. Um, do you have any laxatives down there and toilet paper? Um, I'm not I having a hard time them. pooping. I just said pull your finger out. You're blocking oh everything God. out. Pull your finger out. But I don't want to. I hope you have a good night. Pull Thank it you. Out. It's, it's not going to pass your finger. Right, Pueblo. Pueblo. How can I help you? How can we make the dirt pass? What? Yeah, we're trying to make the dirt pass through. There's dirt, and we're trying to make it pass into the toilet, but we can't make it. Hello? Hello? It's a, it's a dirt... Uh... Broadway and Pablo, how can I help you? Hello? Hey, the dirt won't pass. Thank you for calling the Pueblo Super 8. How can we help you? Hi. The uh, dirt won't pass. I'm I'm trying to make a deposit in the toilet, but it won't go. I tried I tried shaking the handle, but it won't go. It won't pass. It won't. It doesn't go down. It just goes up. 
I've got my handy dandy notepad here. I'm writing it down. The dirt won't pass. Can you help me? No. Do you have any toilet paper? A plunger? All right. Eleven. Hi. I'm Hello. looking for... Hi. You, do you have the camera film still? Camera film? No, not the yeah. not the old Kodak camera films. None of that. You'll uh, find that at Rite Aid or CVS. You got cam like disposable yeah, cameras there? Yeah, disposable cameras there, and they also got All that right. old school film that you're looking for. Because I want to take pictures of my wife here. She's in the nude. Oh, yeah. Those are the best quality photos you could get. I know. Because then yeah. I can scan them. And it'll be real nice. You'll see the grain... You'll see all the mess we made on the floor. Oh, man. Mostly her, though. Who? Mostly her. Who? Your wife. Well, I'm not married. Oh, well, your girl. No, I got a, I got a picture here on a postcard of a beautiful woman. I made a mess on the floor. Oh, man. You better clean that shit up quick. Yeah. Lysol, Lysol, man. Wash your hands. Don't rub you your eyes. You got that there? Get, you might get something. Yeah. All right. I'll be in. Yeah. I'll have the sticky hands. For sure, man. All right. Good night. Good night. Have a good one. You too. Bishop, run. Hey. Um, I'm in a hurry. Hello? I, I'm in a hurry, and I'm going to be late. I was wondering if, like, you could... um put like a cone on one of the pumps for me so I could just get in and use it and leave? Uh, no, I can't do that, but there's eight pumps. So it shouldn't be any problem. Well, Bump well it. like how would I know that? I need you to like put a cone out. Or can I can I prepay some no. gas? No. Can I give you my card right now and like pay? No. Well, dude, I, I really need to, I don't have time to like hop out. I need to just... Pump the gas and go. We uh, well, I'm sorry, but we don't do that. There's there's plenty of. Can you just do no one, one here. There's no one here. There's eight pumps, so it's no problem. Dude, I I just need you to do that this one time, bro. I know I, you can I'm do it. You have it. the computer. You, what what is it? You don't understand. We don't do that. But I need a. How about you do this for me a favor, and then I'll do you a favor next time. Fuck. Thank you for calling Chevron. This is Kim. How can I help you? Hey, I need you to do me a favor right now, and I'll do one later for you. What? I'm going to read you my card. I'm going to put... Hello? Hello? I, I'm going to read you my card number. Put 20 up. Hey, listen to me. Listen to me. I'm going to hang up on Are you. Are you listening? I'm going to hang up on you. Fart. Just do it. No. Fart. Oh. Fart on your hand. Don't fucking like hang up. Don't oh, fucking hang up, bitch. <laughs> Thank you for calling Chevron. Hey, I need a favor, please. All right, may I ask what the favor is? Well, see, if you do me this favor, I might do you a favor later. What I need is I'm going to read you my card number, and I need to put 20 on pump 3. And then just cone it off, because I, I, can't, I can't go in there and I can't get off the car. i got to just pump the gas and get the fuck out of there. Uh, I wouldn't be able to do it using just your card number. Uh, what, what do you need? I, I would need you to physically bring in the card. The system doesn't let us uh, input card numbers like that anymore. What the fuck? Come on, man. You you got there's got to be something. Did you pay twenty bucks for me, and I'll and I'll pay you back. You got cash app? You got Venmo? Uh, I actually just deal in cash when it comes to other people. God damn it! I'm in a really big hurry. You see, this girl said she's home alone, and I'm trying to get that pussy, man. Come on, man. I got no cash, and I need to get there as fast as I can, man. Come on, man. I've been trying to get a pussy for years, man. Uh, I appreciate the, the hustle and the struggle, but 
I don't have the means to help you. I'm sorry. Man, if it was you and you was calling me, I would have done it for you, man. Have you ever been in that situation? Be honest, man. No, I've never been in this situation. I'm, You've I'm never sorry. talked to a girl she said she's home alone and you need to get the fuck over there right now? I mean, I've never had to ask somebody to help me to get over there, no. It's just, it's just I'm, I'm experiencing bad luck right now, man. I just don't got cash. I was going to walk there, but it's too damn far. Who knows yeah. you're supposed to be horny by the time I get there? Man, um, I but, get that. Hello? Hello? Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, yeah, but I really appreciate that, you know, you reached out to me uh, for help, but I'm not in a position to be able to help you like that. I'm really sorry. Ah, God damn it. That's uh, okay, son. I All hope right. one day nobody gets in the way of your pussy, okay? Okay, thank you. I love you. Thank you.